Hi, this is Greg Martin, and we are here at the Ethan Allen Design Center, where I am the senior design consultant. We are here with PCN's Design Corner, and today we're going to talk about wallpaper. It's a huge design trend that's going on right now. And of course, I'm sure most of you out there had lots of wallpaper in your house as you were growing up. It's not your mama's wallpaper anymore. There are some wonderful, wonderful designs. There is there are a, a plethora of colors and textures. And it's a wonderful thing to be able to take one wall and put wallpaper on it and get a big bang and then paint the rest of the walls. Here we have five different kinds of wallpapers with all different kinds of colors. They have bigger patterns to them. If you do a whole room in this, you're going to get a major impact. Rather than commit to a whole room of doing this, I like the idea of doing one wall, an accent wall. What we're going to do is use this wallpaper and make believe that we're going to use this in a den. Here are a couple of paint colors that could coordinate very well with this wallpaper. Actually, this one I'm putting down right now is my favorite. And rather than using a wood tone for accents in the, in the room, we could do the legs of the furniture in black. Rather than using black leather, this is an olive green leather that's really, really pretty. And to give it a lot of texture and a little bit of a feminine look, because right now, a feminine feel, because it's looking a little masculine, is be able to put a fabric like this in there. Beautiful den. Probably the most popular type of wallpaper these days are the grass cloths. They add an absolutely wonderful texture to any room. Be ready to pay a little bit more from, for, for them because it, it takes a lot more to get to this product to be able to put it on your wall. I chose this wallpaper to work on this room. I'm thinking of a family room. Here's a couple of paint colors that would coordinate very, very well with the grass cloth. So what it is, is it's bringing out, both of them are bringing out the color of the grass ex itself. Now, if we're going to put a wood tone with this, this would be really, really pretty, has that barn, yard, barn board sort of look to it. I'm going to use the color red as an accent for different parts of the room. So these are just different fabrics that can be put in there. So this could be a sofa, this could be a chair, this could be pillows. If I were doing this, I would probably do the sofa in something like that, keep that in the solid. Here are some textures that can be done in it. And of course, you need a very nice distressed leather in there on a nice recliner for dad and the dog. For all you women out there, this is speaking to the feminine side. These are all different florals. They're just different scales. This would be beautiful behind a bed or an accent wall in a bedroom. And what we're going to do is work with the one to the far right. If we're going to use this as an accent wall, here are three different colors that could work really well with it. I would prefer to do the white, the off-white, which matches the white of the wallpaper in the other parts of the room to keep it light and airy. I would do painted white furniture. It gives it, again, a little bit of a vintage look. To do some bedding that would coordinate really well with this, this is a mat lise, so this is a quilted coverlet. And what you, we could do from there is do some Euro shams across the back of the bed. And this is my favorite part. This is a wonderful shag rug just underneath the bed, not wall to wall. So basically, if you're going to do a queen size bed, you would do an eight foot by 10 foot shag rug. I can't help you with your design dilemmas if you don't tell me what they are. You can go to PCN's uh, Design Corner via Facebook and you can like me, which would be really, really nice. And you can like PCN for that matter. And you can leave a comment there and I can help you that way. But that's the only way I'm going to succeed and you're going to succeed. So thank you very much. This has been another episode of PCN's Design Corner. I'm Greg Martin. See you soon.